In Greek mythology, Chiron was one of the centaurs. A centaur is half man, half horse. And this one was the son of the Titan, Kronos, and Philyra, who was an Oceanid, or a sea nymph. Chiron lived at the foot of Mount Pelion in Thessaly. Unlike other centaurs who were violent and savage, this centaur was famous for his wisdom and his knowledge of medicine. There are many ancient Greek heroes we're familiar with, including Hercules, Achilles, Jason, and Asclepius, who were instructed by Chiron. Chiron frequently appears in the legends of his grandson, Peleus, and his great-grandson, Achilles. Chiron was accidentally pierced by a poisoned arrow shot by Hercules, and he renounced his immortality in favor of Prometheus, and was placed among the stars as the constellation Centaurus, or what we otherwise know as Sagittarius. So in this ancient myth of Chiron, we come across this concept of the wounded healer. And he was mortally wounded, but being immortal, he was unable to die. And there's this concept of what this planetary asteroid brings to us, which is some kind of wound, some place in our life where we feel like we're not only not good enough, but not lovable, that we are mortally flawed somehow. And in the healing world, you might hear this phrase thrown about, heal or heal thyself. And all of us have this kind of raw spot, this sensitive, wounded spot inside of us. And in human design, raw says that we are useless before a certain age, that age is 50 years old. I don't think of it as um, quite that way, but you know how raw is. He likes to be kind of shocking. And it is kind of a shock when you come to human design and you see that according to our philosophy, or the mechanics really, that we aren't fully mature until we hit our Chiron return. Our maturing process or phase happens between 38 and 44 years old, or, or otherwise known as our Uranus opposition. So for those of you who are listening to me right now, I want to invite you to get a Chiron reading because Chiron can show you where your wound is and the thematics for helping you understand the key to healing that wound.